Hey y'all, Missy here. I am here with one of the journals that I pressed. I want to show you a few things so you'll know what you need to do when you're pressing your journal, okay? Um, where's that middle piece? Right here it is. I'm coming y'all, I promise. Okay, so um, you get this piece with your journal and this is a centerpiece. This helps you when you're pressing it, okay? You don't need it after the fact. It's just for when you're pressing. So you'll put it down in the center and then just tape, put a piece of tape on both sides and then flip it over, put your sublimation print down um, and then just, um, I taped my sublimation print to my butcher paper that I had down and then I just pressed it, okay? 400 degrees, 60 seconds is what I did. Now, I want to show you guys, um, when you're done pressing, you just remove this out off of there. Save it for future use if you want, in case you lose one. Um, your journal will come like this. It has the inside papers, like that. And then you also get um, these sticky pieces. It holds your journal in place, the paper part in place, once you're done pressing, okay? So I'm just going to show you real fast how to do this. You um, just grab a piece and pull it back, and it's going to be really sticky, okay? See how it curled up a little bit? And you just line it up the best you can, and you get it right the first time because it is so sticky, it ain't coming back up. All right, so, but it's super easy. Um, and then I just press down really hard, just like this, okay? Make sure you got it pressed down hard. And then you just grab you another corner because you got another st st um, sticky side, okay? So you're going to have two separate sticky sides. Just grab you a corner. Okay, that corner's better. All right, and pull it back. Now, see how sticky that is? Okay, now what I did, you can do each their own, you know? I'm, um, ha you can put this at the bottom like this. Or you can put it at the top like this. I'm doing mine at the top. Okay, now I line my book up in the middle here, just like this. This is what I'm doing, okay? So if you find a better way, then bless you. But this is what I'm doing. So I line my book up, get it just how I want it, and then I fold it over like this, okay? Once I've done that, I push it down. Push, 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 okay? All right, so that side's done. I'm gonna grab my other one, cause you get two, and you're gonna do the back side. So you just peel, peel it off, just like that. Lay it down. Okay. Push it down real good. Grab you a corner. Some corners might be easier to get than others. Just be patient and work with it. Because you know it is sticky. I'll find one in a second. That's like, yeah, go ahead, peel me. This one's wanting to. All right, there we go. Peel it back. Take it easy when you're peeling it back. It is super strong, okay? And then you can just flip this side right on over or you can stand it up, do it the way I did, and then flip it over. Press real hard, okay? And um, this, is, this design here that you see here, um, this is actually my tumbler design. I did a tumbler. Hold on, let me grab it. Thank you, Gabby. I did, um, this tumbler design right here. And what I did is I just took it and I, um, made a book out of it. So I took the exact same design. Um, they're, let me show you the height and the width real fast. And I'm going to end this because this is just supposed to be about how to put it together. Um, you got uh, almost eight and a half inches tall and about almost six inches wide, okay? Um, I'm pretty sure I, um, did 
eight and a half by 12 on a piece of paper. I just took a tumbler design and um, did it. Just stretched it out. But this is what the book looks like when it's finished. You got a complete nice journal. And that's that one. I already completed this one too. So they're nice and ready to go. Alright guys, and the same thing with your post-it. Your post-it note is going to be the exact same way, okay? Your post-it note is this isn't going to be attached to this. And you're going to have um, this kind of paper with your post-it note to put your post-it note down, okay? So the post-it note is the exact same way. And I'll show that in another video um, another day. But it is the exact same thing. Alright guys, if you have any questions, let us know.